Hi all, I'm Anu, one of the OET trainers at Cosmo. Today I'm going to discuss about OET reading. OET reading consists of, I mean OET reading subtext consists of three parts, part A, B and C. And you will get a total of 60 minutes to complete all these tasks. Okay, so in that part A, you will get only 15 minutes to complete. The remaining 45 minutes is for part B and C. Okay, that is why you reading subtext in the part A, B, and C. So, that is why you are reading the part A, B, and C. So, that is why you are reading the part A, B, and C. So, that is you are reading the part A, B, and C. So, that is why you are reading the part A, B, and C. Okay, so that is why you are reading So, the remaining 45 minutes are part B, and C. You can utilize in either way. You can do the reading test. I mean, you can do the C part first or B part. That's according to your wish. Okay. That's what you can B and C. Alright. So, now I'm going to discuss about part A. Okay. Part A, in that part, you will get four short texts. Okay. Text A, text B, text C and text D. Okay. In that, you will get 20 questions from this part A. So, part A, 4 letter divided into text A, B, C and D. Okay. So, in the, uh, less than 50 seconds, one question, uh, one question complete and I will get to know. So, a train short period. So, usually, in this part A, consists of uh, mainly three types of questions. Multiple choice questions, sentence completion questions and short answer questions. Okay. These are the three types of questions you will get for in a part A text. Alright, so let's move on to part A. I will discuss in detail. As I already told that there are four texts in part A, that's like A, B, C and D. Alright, so part A, I'm using a sample. The heading is um, the use of feeding tubes in pediatrics. If you have that, uh, you can take it or if you download it, that's better. Um, if you have it down print out with you, then it's easy for you to follow me. All right. Okay. Anyway, you can have a look. I can tell you one thing that please do not try to read the entire passage, entire test. Okay. So as I think, or you question, I to less than 50 seconds. So, you whole passage test reading. Ninka the complete and I don't know what to do. Okay, 15 seconds. Please remember, keep in mind always. Okay, so I can provide you some tips. Once you get a question like this, you need to read the main heading. In this, the main heading is the use of feeding tube in pediatrics and read the subtext of each text. For in text A, the subtext is pediatric nasogastric tube use. And the again, it's divided as issues associated with pediatrics nasogastric tube feeding, which includes okay. That means in the number comments like um, e text length and about another pediatric nasogastric tube in the use of and under other the end the key issues are not associated with another okay. Then look at uh, uh, text B inserting the nasogastric tube, nasogastric tube insertion could shine about another and second divided into white bore and fine bore, and also uh, the techniques and uh, the measurements of this tube it's in, illustrated in this again okay. then the third one i mean the text c is a graphical representation as i already told that you may get a graph or a chart okay so this is a graphical representation you can just go through this then for text d it's administration of feeds or fluids via a feeding tube so any other feed Okay, number full IT then I watch you bone and just have subheadings and main headings. Okay, now question letter. As I already told you, that three types of questions on the norm multiple choice questions, short answer questions, and sentence completion questions. Okay, so first question is always uh, this one to seven questions is always a multiple choice question. Okay. For each question, 1 to 7, decide which text, A, B, C or D, the information comes from. You may use any letter more than once. Remember, you may use any letter more than once. Because, if you have text, but question 7 questions under. So, you may use any letter more than once. Alright. Now again, 
I will look into the questions. In which text can you find information about? The risk of feeding a child via a nasogastric tube. Okay, first question is multiple choice. The risk of feeding a child via a nasogastric tube. Okay, so nasogastric tube is a child or child is a risk. Okay, so we can have the sub. And uh, we subtext, I uh, mean, uh, headings on the Okay. Pediatric nasogastric tube use. Text A is Then, issues associated with pediatric nasogastric tube. There are a lot of issues like procedure for inserting the tube is traumatic for the majority of the children. And aspiration if the tube is incorrectly placed. And uh, increased risk of gastroesophageal reflex with prolonged use, and the patient may like to pull out the tube, making regular air insertion if necessary. So these are the risks. It's already written. So the answer is A. All right. The answer is A. Do not write text A. You can write it like A. Okay. So let's move on to the next question. Calculating the length of the tube that will be required for a patient. Once again, calculating the length of the tube that will be required for a patient. Okay. So, text A and then we are making the nasogastric pediatric uh, nasogastric tube in the user and the risk one. Then now what's written in text B? So it's written that in for white boy, the tube size is I mean the size of the pediatric tube was from six French to uh, 10 frames that's uh, it's just for uh, the short term use and for fine bore it's for long term use and the size varies okay in general the tube size is 6 french for standard feeds and 7 french uh, to 10 french for high density and fiber feeds okay usually the tube size uh, the length of the tube varies from 55 cm 75 cm and 85 cm so it's clearly written here so we can, without any doubt, you can write it down. The answer is B. All right. Hope you understand uh, till now. Okay. So this is part A, one to seven questions. That's multiple choice questions. Now we can move on to the short answer questions. Okay. So let's move on to question A to 15. Before that, I can tell you one more tip that I all I told you that please do not uh, read the entire text. Instead, you can use skimming and scanning method and fast reading method. All right, keep in mind. So let's move on to eight to 15 questions. In this, answer each of the questions eight to 15 with a word or short phrase from one of the texts. Again, okay. answer each of the questions from eight to 15 with a short, with a word. Okay, with a word or a short phrase from one of the texts. Each answer may include words, numbers or both. Remember this, words, numbers or you can use word or a short phrase. Okay, so word writing long sentence. Okay, so we can move on to the question. What type of tube should you use for patients who need nasogastric feeding for an extended period? What type of tube should you use for patients who need nasogastric feeding for an extended period? Okay, so you can uh, look into the question text. Okay, so in this first one, as I told you, that it's a pediatric use of nasogastric tube. Okay, so and uh, so in this, um, and the other one chance la, alay. Pediatric nasogastric tube bane parayana na. Maybe vara, maybe vara dili kya. So we can just have a uh, long, long term uh, gastrostomy feeding may be more suitable. Nasogastric feeding may be more suitable. But the question is, uh, what type of tube? So in which one uh, among this passage is talks about the type of tube? Look at pass text B. It's written as uh, what type of tubes? White bore and fine bore. For white bore, it's for short term use, and fine bore is long term use. The synonym for long term use is that what? The extended period. So we got the answer. It's fine bore. Okay. That means. 
നിങ്ങൾക്ക് ചിലപ്പോൾ എക്സാക്റ്റ് ആയിട്ടുള്ള വേർഡ് തന്നെ കിട്ടണം എന്നില്ല സിനോണിം ആയിരിക്കും തന്നേക്കുന്നത് സോ ഇതിൽ എന്ത് പറയുന്നത് പർട്ടിക്കുലർ ആയിട്ട് പറയുന്നുണ്ട് ലോങ് ടേം യൂസ് ഫോർ ലോങ് ടേം യൂസ് ഫൈൻ ബോ ട്യൂബസ് യൂസിങ് സോ ഇൻ ദസ് ദർ ആസ്കിങ് യു അബൌട്ട് ദ എക്സ്റ്റെൻഡ് പീരിയഡ് വിച്ച് ടൈപ്പ് ഓഫ് ട്യൂബ് ഇസ് യൂസ് ഫോർ എൻ എക്സ്റ്റെൻഡ് പീരിയഡ് ദാറ്റ് മീൻസ് ലോങ് ടേം യൂസ് ദാറ്റ് ഇസ് ഫൈൻ ബോൾ ഓക്കെ സോ നെക്സ്റ്റ് Uh, we can move on to the next type that is questions 16 to 20 so let's move on to question number 16 to 20 okay this set of questions is um usually sentence completion questions usually you will get sentence completion questions in 16 to 20 okay so we can look at the questions complete each of the sentence 16 to 20 with a word with a word or short phrase from one of the text each answer may include words numbers or both all right so idu ningle short answer or a word or a number which one is the complete end the sentence completion question aayirikka okay so a question is if a feeding tube is not straight when you unwrap it you should dash it okay സോ ഒരു ഫീഡിങ് ട്യൂബ് സ്ട്രെയിറ്റ് അൺറാപ്പ് ചെയ്യുമ്പോൾ സ്ട്രെയിറ്റ് അല്ല എന്നുണ്ടെങ്കിൽ നിങ്ങൾ എന്താണ് ചെയ്യുന്നത് അതാണ് ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻ ഇഫ് അ ഫീഡിങ് ട്യൂബ് ഇസ് നോട്ട് സ്ട്രെയിറ്റ് വെൻ യു അൺറാപ്പ് ഇറ്റ് യു ഷുഡ് ഡാഷ് ഇറ്റ് എന്ത് ചെയ്യും സോ ഹാസ് യു ഷുഡ് വി ക്യാൻ ചെക്ക് ദ ടെക്സ്റ്റ് ഓക്കെ ടെക്സ്റ്റ് എ ആസ് എ ടോൾ യു അർലിയർ ഇറ്റ്സ് സേസ് അബൌട്ട് ദ പീഡിയാട്രിക് നാസു ഗ്യാസ്ട്രിക് ട്യൂബ് ആൻഡ് ഇഷ്യൂസ് അസോസിയേറ്റഡ് വിത്ത് ഇറ്റ് in text b inserting the nasogastric tube and the general tube size and the uh, general things okay so wash hands and place the equipment if needed in a clean way like general instruction they are written in the text so maybe number answer idinathayirikkum okay namukku nokka so yes idinathund endana like uh, if you have uh, this passage with you then just check this bullet point 1 2 3 4 4 th bullet point i'm sorry uh, it's uh, written in the th- second bullet point yes check the tube is intact then stretch it to remove any shape retained from being packaged okay check the tube is intact tube intact yanam check yanam then stretch it stretch yanam endina to remove any shape retain from being packaged so package il endengilu ningalku foldings angane endengilu undengilu stretch cheyam unwrap cheyam endeyanam stretch cheyanam so the answer is stretch okay if a feeding tube is not straight when you unwrap it you should stretch it all right so i can write it down here okay If a feeding tube is not straight, when you unwrap it, you should stretch it. It's written in the second bullet point that you can see if you have a printout with you. Check the tube is intact, then stretch it to remove any shape retained from being packaged. Okay. So, I'm reminding for, for third, three questions will be like this. So, this is our part A. So, I hope you understand well. Keep in mind, one more time, I can tell you that please do not try to read the entire passage. read it uh, in a fast way and use skim and scan method okay first you need to read the heading of the sentence i mean heading of the passage and subheadings then you can find out the uh, fi- you can easily find out the answers all right so please uh, practice uh, well because you will get only 15 minutes to complete task a all right so let's move on to part b and c Okay, so I will have to tell you one thing. Part A, you will have to answer the question in part A. Okay, you will have to answer the question in part A. Hmm? Uh, a is multiple choice, 1 to 6 or 8 to 7, uh, 8 to 15. That, uh, uh, send, I mean, question and short answer type and 16 to 20 multiple choice. So, all of you will have to answer the question in part A. But in part B and C, you need to darken the circle remember you need to darken the circles like for example um, just for a demo if it's a uh, the answer is uh, part this a then you need to darken the circle in a proper way okay you need to darken the entire circle in a proper way but keep in mind if you're not sure about the particular answer then do not darken unnecessarily because uh, uh, it's very difficult for you to 
arise. Okay, that's just for a demo. Okay, please keep that in your mind. Okay, so beam C, you can circle dark and chair on the So we can move into the B part. Okay, uh, we can move into the B and C. So in B and C, you will get a total of 45 minutes. So, if you want to do it, you can do it, it's up to you and it's up to your convenience. Okay, so, now you can do it, B will do 6 short passages. If you want to do it, you can do it in B part. In version 2.0, you can do it in 6 short answers in B part. आ सिक्स शॉर्ट आंसर्स लेने को रिक्वेस्टिंग करना, देन आदर डे मून ऑप्शंस करना, ए बी एंड सी ऑप्शंस करना, यू कैन चूज द बेस्ट अकॉर्डिंग टू द टेक्स्ट, यू रीड द टेक्स्ट एंड चूज अकॉर्डिंग टू द बेस्ट, ओके, सो इन पार्ट बी आस आई टोल्ड यू दैट यू विल गेट सिक्स डिफरेंट शॉर्ट पैट uh, you can uh, take up to 2 minutes. One question in the is 2 minutes to spend here. Okay, total of 12 minutes to spend here. If you want to spend 15 minutes to spend here, but it's better to, um, what, better to take only 12 minutes. That means you can spend only 2 minutes. And that is a better way because parts are not going to be lengthy. Okay, so if you have the text with you, just um, keep up it, then you can follow easily. Alright, so in this, um, the uh, in this, I can see that the question is for questions 1 to 6, choose answer A, B, or C, which you think it's best according to the text. So, we can go to the text. The question first question is if vaccines have been stored incorrectly. So, vaccines incorrect like the story and the button and question if vaccines have been stored incorrectly. So, definitely we can. Think and that game. Namka assume chair number in the Ola subtext vaccine version of Parana Namka assume chair. Okay, then look at the sub options. First one is this should be reported. Okay, then the second one is staff should be this should dispose of them securely. The third one is they should be sent back to the supplier. So you have three options here this should be reported, staff should dispose of them securely, and the third one is they should be sent back to the supplier. Okay, so namka ये test का इलान निकला open चाहिए वैसे ना ना रखें because ना निंका इन्हें follow जाना है तो easy है कि alright, so the cosmetic side लेके तो ना नॉइज़ इस side लाके available है ना so please नेस गैस रिक्टिव फीडिंग निंका का इलान निकला please open this booklet alright, so so नम्रा नियम बार मुझे नम्रा vaccine ने कुछ यानी तो पारे ना तो मंसले so उत्तर रीडिया न important idea to point out. So, you can think of a pet and you can think of a pet. Okay. You can think of a pet and you can think of a pet. You can think of a sentence by sentence or word by word. Just a quick idea. You can think of a quick idea. B part and you can think of a quick idea. So, take less than one minute. So, take less than one minute. I think one minute is less than 30 seconds. Okay. Quick idea. Then, this is the answer in your last section. Look at the last section. Despite best practices, call chain break. Okay, I can read this uh, the whole passage for you. Manual extract, effective call chain. That's the main heading of this text. The call chain is a system of transporting and storing vaccines within the temperature range of 2 degrees Celsius to 8 degrees Celsius from the place of manufacture to the point of administration. Okay. Maintenance of the call chain is essential for maintaining vaccine's potency and, in turn, vaccine effectiveness. Purpose built vaccine refrigerators, PBVR, are the preferred means of storage for vaccines. Domestic refrigerators are not designed for the special temperature needs of vaccine storage. Despite best practices, cold chain breaches sometimes occur. Do not discard or use any vaccine exposed to temperature below 2 degrees Celsius or above 8 degrees Celsius without obtaining further advice. Alright, do not discard or use any vaccine exposed to temperature below 2 degrees Celsius or above 8 degrees Celsius. Okay, 
So, all of clear right to it under. Uh, 2 degrees Celsius or 8 degrees Celsius in a temperature breezy angle, do not discard. So, uh, should do not discard. So, we can easily find it that this answer is wrong. All right. So, let's move on. Isolate vaccines and contact, contact the state or territory public health bodies advice of the national immunization program vaccines and the Manufacture for privately purchased vaccines. Okay, so in the way, send back, they should be sent back to the supplier in the without obtaining further advice, isolate vaccines, contact state of um, and contact the state of territory public health bodies for advice, the national immunization program and to privately state vaccines. Send back to the supplier in the then the remaining is this should be reported. Yes, it's clearly written in this. Isolate the vaccine and contact the state or territory public health bodies for advice on the national immunization program vaccines. Okay. So and the manufacturer for privately purchased vaccines. So that is the report. So answer in there A. Okay. So hope you understand part B. Let's move on to part C. Okay. So in part C, you will get two long passages and you have a lot of information in these passages. It's, sorry to say that it's very difficult for me to cover the entire passage because part C is divided into again into two texts. Text A and text B. Usually these are the long passages you will get and it may contain around six or seven paragraphs in each text. Okay. So, uh, in each uh, passage, the other passage is seven answers, seven questions. Remember, the pa part C is almost similar. I mean, the question answers are marked in the part B or similar. Like, this is the A, A, B, C, D. There are four options. So, this is the correct answer. That is the circle dark and chill. Okay. But, uh, B is the only answer. Moon answers, uh, moon uh, and the moon is a, um, my choices in good to love it. In part C, you will get four choices. Okay, answers choice in all negative. Okay, as well, choose the best. A, that's not correct. So, uh, usually, in the part C, when the question is in a like the writer suggests that the potential for harm for from asbestosis is increased by because this test is about asbestosis, that's why they are written like this. Okay. Usually, writers suggest that. Alingil, someone opi someone's opinion, alingil, um, survey suggests that. I'm going to ask you a question. Okay, uh, different types of questions, I'll ask you a type of question. Hmm? So, if you ask a question, you can ask a part B, you can ask a question, you can ask a part B, you can ask a part B, but in part C, please don't read the entire passage because you can ask a question. Uh, because already 45 minutes left, uh, 10 to 15 minutes part uh, B ki vendi poom. So the remaining matra ninka part C ki ayayi to get to know. So, so ninka 14 questions complete yaan. So ninka part B full light of argue on ingle. It's not possible to recollect all the things in your memory. So try to avoid that. Okay, instead you can use the scheming and scanning method or proofreading method or you can, uh, it's not proofreading method, you can select the keywords and find out the answer. That's the best way to, uh, uh, what answer your part C questions? Okay, so move on. Like, writer suggested. So, if you get a question like this, then please do not read the entire passage, then you can only focus on to the writer's opinion. Okay, because your question is writer suggests that. So, focus on to the writer's opinion and you will get the answer. Okay, usually, uh, either in like past paragraph, I said, okay, answers questions. I mean, you can answer usually. Okay. But particular paragraph particular answer. But thing usually first day or question you don't think pass paragraph I suppose, then definitely the answer get it. Okay. So you know remember writer suggests that. So write an opinion hoga, then uh, particular passage, I mean a paragraph and uh, one or two, three or two or three lines are the other keywords that people and other two or three words, uh, three sentences why then come back to the uh, answers options that were, that is given to you ningu thannikana options nokka adile ningu vaaki pottane manasile or randanna andarikku alla annalla so aa randanna eliminate cheyidolaya okay elimination method you can use elimination method in this 
then focus on to the remaining two answers if you have any doubt you can go back and check again then uh, what dark in the exact answer okay so this is one type of question so the word ubiquitous in the meaning and chojekin and then as per just why person could a paragraph le paragraph one nila in the related la meaning and chicken us tell them the paragraph passage on no kyoga in the answer chicken because of the widespread use of fast the stores its fibers are ubiquitous in the environment okay then i'm the sub options and i can end on each other can be found everywhere the last for a long time have an unchanging nature and are natural substances so the question is the word ubiquitous in paragraph one suggests that so it's clearly written as because of the widespread use of fast videos its fibers are ubiquitous in the environment so what is the meaning of ubiquitous in this that means can be found everywhere okay so the answer a is the right answer so it can be found everywhere okay so e type of questions then next type of questions and link and do another in the third paragraph the writer highlights the disagreement about so in the third paragraph or in the second paragraph i'm going to learn it to questions get out of it so think directly in the um a third paragraph like for example so it is one two three so the third paragraph of that again okay so if you have the booklet with you it's easy for you as i already told you because um follow generator is easier okay so in the third paragraph, I'm sure you can easy at the third paragraph find out. So in the third answer, so you can see side of the link of an angle mark. One, two, three. Upon link of pattern in the end, the third paragraph, no, no, third and the condition of second, no, no, pattern no can it look very so easy. So usually in a lot of questions, I think the part seal good enough. So please remember. Or a clip full light of why can you can go some make it okay I'm gonna have a render type long passages are in the part of seal it up okay so all together reading or in the moon the part I can see reading subtext is divided into three parts part a b and c part a level on the four subtext subtext on an ingo I mean for passage text on a null passage on a null paragraph at any divided they come well text you on a then part C, B nor anya six different short passages are in part C nor anya then that divided the come each one nor anya for a long passage are in so total time is 60 minutes okay I can tell you one more thing most of my students have told me that it's the a difficult part okay but I can tell you that if you practice well if you like that reading part then you will definitely you can you will definitely get good marks in your OIT reading okay so prepare well, study well. One more thing I can tell you that or you answer wrong hour and clear. Think upon out of 42 on a total question. So other link 30 get in which the remaining 12 are link wrong. But find out here every day on our 12 questions and answers 30 in the country. So in the matter and inka ningla than a ningla than a so I am in the amateur loo ninka engine and the tea that where you went wrong then it's easy for you to uh, improve your writing and reading score okay so every day on the day in the country to mother ninka next time at the day that team not to go on but you also ninka or the one in passage in book that you do mean country to share your kitchen but no car okay all the best for your reading thank you